Hey, what's up, family? I'm Rachel. And I'm Joe. And we are Two, two Crazy, crazy Ketos. Ketos. We got a package in the mail today. I love mail. I am really excited about this package. It's from a company called Real Salt. Real Salt. Yes. We'll find out more about this product right, right after, after this. this. So Rachel and I eat a lot of salt. How much salt would you say we partake of? We sir? eat <laughs> this much salt. Clearly, we endorse this product. Yes. It's a drum. It's a drum. I bought this. They, they didn't give me this for free, but this is 10 pounds of salt. Well, I think that this shows that we don't endorse anything that we don't like legitimately buy yes. on, on the regular. We, we use salt. So I bought a big giant tub of salt. How much is this? It's 10, 10 pounds. pounds. Yeah. And that probably will only last us like a year. So anyway, That's a lot enough about being funny. So real salt. Like I said, we do use a lot of salt. But I kind of wanted to see what a normal person might use in salt to get started. So I actually wrote to the company and asked them to send us just kind of a sampling for of, you guys for you guys to see of the products that that they have yeah before we get into this though i do want to talk a little bit about salt because we have a lot of new people who watch us and message us and Hi, by newbies. the way we really like that we you know that. and yes we're a small channel but we do try to answer everything and we started this channel because we're passionate about keto and it was really about getting all the information about keto out and the health benefits because yeah. we experienced so many health benefits. Yeah, if it was just about weight loss, I think we would have just kept our results to ourselves. Right. But you know, if you've had like a mom like I have that was a type two diabetic for you know twenty years and now is no longer diabetic, or in Joe's case, you know, I remember the first eight years of our marriage driving around you know with a handicap sticker right. on her car because he couldn't walk. He had such like just really crippling arthritis right. in the pins in his ankle. And to now not have that tag on our car, I mean, we are proud to walk that's further right. and further, that's you know, right. from a parking space. So yeah, that's why we, we really do want to inform people so, yeah. about the health benefits. So like, if, so long as you guys are asking us questions, we will do our best to answer them. And if I can't answer them, I will refer you to where I think you can find the answers, yeah. you know, so we're not doctors. No. I can only give you information based on our personal experience what experienced, and what we've researched, yeah. but there are some really good knowledgeable doctors who believe in keto who are on YouTube and I can always refer you to them. But one of the questions that we do get a lot is about salt, mm -hmm. you know? So I did want to just address that the salt that we grew up with, which is like just pure table salt, what you're going to get when you go to like a restaurant or something like that. That's just table salt, and it's really void of any of the nutrition of that you need and why we're using salt in our diet on keto. I used to use a tremendous amount of that table salt. So much so that she would salt her food, and when you lifted up her plate, you could see where the plate was. You could, and I think it's kind of funny to note um, a difference between the salt we use now and the salt I used back then. It seemed like my amount of salt needed to be like escalated, escalated, escalated. Like I, I never could like enjoy a salty taste. Now, I feel like we do use a lot of salt, but I don't need to salt my food like crazy, right. like I and did. The one of the, the biggest reason you want salt on keto is you, cause you want to get your minerals from it to, so you can avoid dehydrate, avoid dehydration and avoid the keto flu and that kind of stuff. Now, for the last two years, we've been using pink salt, pink Himalayan mm -hmm. salt, which is a very, very good salt. Also, it's pretty. It's pretty. You know, but you really on keto, you want to use either a pink Himalayan salt or some kind of like a Celtic salt, like, or, you know, a good sea salt. We have switched to real salt for a few reasons. Number one, it tastes better. It's incredible. It just absolutely Bold. tastes better. Um, and it's from America. It comes from Utah. So it's obviously not coming from the Himalayan mountains and which is where pink Himalayan salt comes from. Like if you're not going to use real salt, I would definitely suggest only using pink Himalayan salt because that, those salt mines and these salt mines are really untouched, you know, like by from nature with all the chemicals and everything in the environment because of where they're coming from. God really does do it better. Yes. <laughs> So let's go ahead and open this. Like Rachel said, 
we did not buy this. We asked them if they could send it to us so that we can let you guys know about Real Salt. So I don't even know what's in this, what they sent us or yeah. anything like that. We obviously have our own supply we, of salt. We buy our salt by the paint bucket. <laughs> So uh, we aren't affiliates with uh, mm -hmm. Real Salt yet, but I will leave a link down below of like, you know, how you can get it. So let's see, they have a box in here. Better with Real Salt, everyday sea salt, amazing taste, and it is mined in America. I like this box. Ooh, oh, what is this? What is that? I don't know, I it's guess a it's like a cutting out? board. Oh, Ooh, I love these things. I'm gonna pop them. <laughs> okay, so let's see what they have in here. So here's the box that they've sent us. I popped what it. What are you doing? I just love these things. So, yep, see this is the invoice and they actually didn't charge us for it because we asked them to let us let you guys see it. Let you so, guys see it. This is, I guess. Oh, they're little. Little salt packets. Yeah. Oh, oh my gosh, how cute are they? Okay, so we have a bunch of little salt packets. You know what? I'm hoping that some of these like like Disney World, McDonald's, and some of these companies start using these alternative salt. Okay, so that's the box. Cutie I'm patootie. saving that box. Yes. Okay, so here's what we have in here. We they gave us a 10 ounce container of salt. Okay. And just so you can see, like I'm gonna try to put this up to the camera and see if you can it, see. It almost you looks like there's salt see, and pepper in there. Look at all but like the, the minerals. minerals that are in there. Do you see all those little dots and stuff in there? Um, I mean, that's it. Just has such an incredible taste. I actually think it has a better taste than pink salt. I, just, I know it does. It just is an incredible, incredible taste. Okay, so they gave us that. We have not tried any of these. So they Ooh. have an organic seasoned salt. Oh, yum. Okay. Does it say what's in there? What else is in there? There is no way I can read I, that. I can I'm read old. it for you. You ready? Mm -hmm. It's got ancient sea salt. What a surprise. <laughs> uh, organic garlic, organic onion, organic coriander, organic mustard, organic celery seed, organic black pepper, organic paprika, organic turmeric, and organic parsley. This is going to taste fantastic on like hamburger. Yeah, I can't wait I for I can that. see you putting it on a then steak. Then they, they sent us an organic garlic salt. Ooh, yum, I love garlic salt. And they sent us an onion salt. Let's go ahead and crack these open. And no them. carbs. These guys, is that the same as this or? It's this is salt? onion salt. And this one is garlic salt. We're sharing it in the house anyway. Oh I know, right? Gosh, that, is <gasps> that is amazing. Oh my gosh. That is, oh, okay, so that, you just did um, a video on, I'm your, hiding that. on your pedo crackers. Yeah. Oh yeah, I'm hiding that, by the way. That is delicious. I'm definitely hiding that because you're going to use it all, I know. Mm. Oh, wow. I Taste that garlic drink. salt. Oh my goodness. That is that it's like the perfect combination of garlic. this is not like what you get at no. walmart no this is not like normal taste now this seasonings. is and again you can look inside of there and you can see the minerals all in there within what is in this what are they does it say what they're putting in this well, like, without just, spilling it i read all what are all the, the uh, other ingredients though it doesn't say I actually read them all i didn't hear you i was too busy <laughs> opening stuff i want to taste this <laughs> Oh my gosh. I can taste the celery in it. Did you read celery? Because I taste celery. I don't, I don't think I, wait, no, I do think I taste said celery. Uh, yes, celery seed. This is awesome. That. I'm ordering some of this stuff. How much is, I'm gonna, I've got my, my little iPad that over is, here. This is Thanksgiving in a container, right? This is amazing. So this is $5.75 for this, that for that thing. Are you kidding? No, I own. Oh, they actually have a big giant 32 ounce one for $24. I think that's a good value. That, that is like, you know, the big giant. How much do we pay for those giant size things at Penn Dutch? I don't know. I don't is know. it like. But this is all organic and this yeah, is a good Yeah, no, but I'm just salt. saying, like, I'm trying to reference comparatively. So, okay, let's, let's get into so we don't make a 30 minute video that they don't want to watch. <laughs> okay, then they had sent us these. These are awesome. Look, I have one over here. Like, I bought one of these. These are so cute. These are awesome, and you can see how big they are. Oop. Now you can't. 
So it's a little, it's a little thing. And what it's designed for is put Keep it in your briefcase, put it in your pocket, put it in your purse. You're going out like you, you just if you're out in purse, you're like you don't want to like use the, the restaurant salt. salt. You want a good mineral salt, so you just always have this with you. And it's a little two ounce jar of salt. And it's way more inconspicuous than the paint bucket. Yeah, you and you can that. refill these once you open it. The one that I just dropped on the floor is like has been open, so you can refill these. That's good. It's so cute. So these actually, I'll just to give you some prices. And again, we're not current affi currently affiliates. No, you know, with them, we just love this product. These are two dollars. But the only thing, is, they're so cute. But it's a nice jar. It's, a, it's it is. plastic, so you don't have to worry about it breaking or but anything like that. But it's, it's just a nice, duty. convenient little thing. So, and this pouch here. This uh, container here. Say, that's not a pouch. Is ten ounces and it's five dollars and seventy five cents. So now, real salt is a doll, a couple of dollars more than um, on Amazon anyway. Mm -hmm. Than buying the pink Himalayan salt, but it also depends on where you're getting your pink Himalayan salt and what yeah. the quality of. If you're looking at the same type of quality, like from a really good source, yeah. it's pretty much the same price. But yeah, you're getting a much better salt. Because, I mean, I saw some nondescript pink Himalayan salt in, like, Burlington Coat Factory. Yeah. And I was like, I don't know where this came from. Now, they also do, so just so you have an idea, they once you buy this, this container is refillable. So you can buy, like, a 26-ounce bag, which would fill this, like, almost three times. Oh, so you can buy it by the bag also. Right, so once you buy it by the bag. It's not this or paint bucket. No, once you buy this by the bag, so you're going to pay $6 for this, and then you can buy a 26-ounce bag, refill this three times, and that's $10. So you save oh, nice. a little bit. So you get the container once. Now, you don't have to even buy it this way. You can you can buy use your own salt shakers or anything yeah, like this. Yeah, this Dollar is nice Tree shaker. sells them. Okay, then... Uh, they also have, which they didn't send us, but they also have a kosher salt, like if you're using it for oh, meat nice. tenderizing and yeah. stuff like that. And they have a super fine, like a powder salt, which you what would, would use that be for? popcorn, that kind of oh. stuff. Are so, so, you eating a lot of popcorn No, lately? I'm not, but... You could probably put it on those popped rinds, the yes. cheese rinds. Now it's, I mean, yeah, you could use it for something like that. And then they also do have like the big giant crystals, like if you have a salt grinder. Oh, nice. So they have a lot of different options. Just in case anybody is interested, we got this. We bought this on Amazon. The Tubbo Salt. And it was 40 bucks. Wow. That's, honestly, that's not bad. Yeah. Because this stuff is good. Yeah. And it's good until December of 2023. Not a shot in the dark that will last in our house till December of 2023. Isn't that, that's, that's almost frightening, but. So, so that's our video. And you know what? I mean, they, they were kind enough to send us all these. We're going to save these. I'm going to bring these to church. But I think we should give this away. I'm going to give that away. I'm going to give one of these away. Yeah. They probably don't want the things we put our finger in. No, I want these anyway. I'm not giving these away. Sorry guys. I'm <laughs> keeping this. But we obviously don't need salt because we have one yeah. of these and we have a giant tub to refill do, it. Do, do, do. So we're going to just, we're, let's give this away. They gave it to us. Let's give it away to somebody else. Wimpy, wimpy, wimpy. Hefty, hefty, hefty. <laughs> So today is Monday the, what is today? The, the 18th. Monday 18th. the 18th. We are leaving for Texas tomorrow. Tomorrow morning. And let's see. So this video will probably go up on Wednesday. Okay. Okay. So how about we do a drawing for this. Sorry, I'm looking at my iPad. We will do a drawing for this on Wednesday the 27th. We, we have a lot of drawings. Next we do. Week. We have a lot of giveaways. I love giving stuff away. Again, and our th feeling is, is the companies were nice enough to give it to us for free so that we can show it to you yeah. guys. And so we're just going to give it back out to you guys. I, I so, am legitimately buying a bunch of these seasoning salts, though. I am definitely ordering some of these. Those these, are good. These are that good. So... So Wednesday the 27th, we will do a drawing. We'll film us doing the drawing. It'll be a random thing. All you have to do to enter is do us a favor and share this video with somebody that you know. Yeah. Um, hit the like button on mm -hmm. it and then comment down below that you want the salt. Yeah. Or like that you want to try the salt or what kind of salt you use. Anything. Any, anybody who leaves a comment, we'll put your name in it. How's that? Doesn't get any easier than that. So, and we will send them off to you. We'll pay for the shipping. Yeah. Okay. All right. So that's our video for today. Hopefully you guys have learned something. Maybe you didn't know about real salt. I mean, we only recently found out about it about six months ago. I doubt very many people knew you could buy salt by the paint bucket. Yeah. <laughs> so 
If you, uh, if you like what you saw, do us a favor, hit the like button down below. And when you do hit the like button and comment, you will get entered into the drawing for it. If you aren't already, please subscribe to our channel and go ahead and hit the little bell icon. And that way, every single time we upload a new video, you will be alerted to it. Yep. And by the way, also, so anytime you look at our recipes on our website, which mm -hmm. you can visit at twocrazyketos.com with the number two. Mm -hmm. Anytime where you see the recipe calls for pink salt, you can use this. So I'll probably eventually go through and change all the recipes to real salt. But yeah. So. Until next time. Bye. Bye.